Hi, so in this video, I'm going to show how to fix the runtime exceptions that you might be getting after updating your Android SDK to the latest version. Um, previously, whenever you created a Hello World app, you were only having one project that was created. But if you updated in the last few days to the latest um, uh, ADT bundle, then you might be seeing two projects instead of one. So here is what it is right now. So I go create a new project, new My Hello World. Keep all the defaults, keep going with a blank activity. And as you can see, now you have a layout name activity main and a fragment layout name fragment underscore main. And then click on finish. So currently, this is what is going on. Like you have two projects, your My Hello World. Uh, previously, it was only this project that was being created, but now you have um, App Compat version 7. So basically, all it has is two libraries, which is Android support version 4.jar and Android support v7 app compat.jar. And these are the only two uh, additions in this um, uh, new version that you have. Um, and this is connected to my hello world so if you go to my hello world and look at its properties go to this android um, select this android and then you will see that this is actually connected to this other project um, and of course for java folks who know how you connect the two projects together how you link up it's not this way but in the android world this is how you do it um, and the problem, however, is when you try to run this on the emulator, you might be having uh, runtime exceptions being thrown. And that is, uh, and it must, might be saying that the, it's not able to find the class for the support libraries. And as you can see, the support libraries are right here in the uh, project that it is referencing. However, those support libraries doesn't seem to be invoked during runtime. It's, it's not really getting uh, compiled properly and it is it's having issues finding out the uh, class files for it so to fix that what you do is go to this open this libs if it is not open for you already open this libs and select each one of those jar files go to build path then say add to jar both of them so add both of them to build path and add to build path so once you do that the reference libraries come here and then go to the properties um, and at this point go to java path uh, build path and go to the order and export you will now see that these two jar files are included check them out and then uncheck this android dependencies and then click ok and that's about it you're all set now if you run your hello world app you should not be seeing any exceptions being thrown Here it is getting deployed and you don't see any exceptions being popped up here. So that's about it. Thank you.